Hi there. My name is Julie Eckert. I'm a visual artist, that is photographer, videographer, mixed media, watercolor ink, and illustrator author. I'm so pleased to be part of the artists accepted to participate in a Lennox and Addington studio tour, September 9th, September 10th. Uh, I've also been given the great opportunity to be the photographer, videographer, for the Greater Napanee Art Association artists and on the studio tour. I've been a photographer since I was 12 years old. Started off with my Polaroid swinger. Yes, that's dating me. Um, I worked at Polaroid and I worked at uh, Snap Quincy newspaper for about six years for both of them and it was a great experience. I learned a lot. I want, also wanted to be an artist since I was 12 years old, but discouraging words when I was younger uh, that I wasn't good enough, hmm, well, that was a challenge, so I met the challenge. When I retired, I became serious. I've won many awards, well, patting myself on the back, I won many awards with my photography and with my art, so I'm really pleased about that. Uh, the Fishing Game is one of my books that I wrote and it's based on a true story of my grandchildren and I did the watercolor ink and the illustration of course so I'm really proud of this this was my first book so I'm, I'm really happy about this book I also created a book uh, it's called my therapy it's a watercolor ink um, well it's a book that I can show people that this is what I do so this one was called my therapy reason being the watercolor ink process got me through COVID. I mean, that was a tough time and I was really to have my process. My therapy watercolor ink mixed media. And then that's a book. And then my photographic art is also a book. And I'll show you those in a, another video. This is my book, photographic art. And this book was a real pleasure to put together. So it's front cover. Went to uh, Arizona one year. Oh my gosh, I fell in love with, with Arizona. I uh, went on this uh, Antelope Canyon tour and it was just fascinating. In fact, the pictures don't even do it justice. I mean, look it. And it was like a, a spiritual journey. It was just uh, like following the right path. Oh, and this says on the right path. And this one says spirit in the sky. I used the mirror so you could get an idea that I'm uh, videoing my own video. <laughs> uh, there's another one, Arizona, Towards the Light. You get such a really spiritual feeling when you walk through these, these canyons. The colors are awesome, the lighting, oh, you need to go. There's an old one, Cows in the Field. I like doing um, animals and Things like that. We are families. A little, um, little can of geese, uh, goslings, or yeah, I guess you call them ducks, goslings. I don't know, but anyway, they were just all snuggled up, and I couldn't resist but take a picture of them. And then my neighbor's cat, which I also did a painting of. I just, uh, I love the coarseness on the tongue. <laughs> uh, magical mystery tour and uh, love, joy, peace, laughter. I really enjoy these pieces because it's, um, it's taking your photographs and merging them. So you might have a background of a certain color and then you merge uh, a photograph in or two or three or four and this is what you get. Sometimes you get some real magic coming up and uh, I figure this was a pretty magical piece and I'm, I'm happy with it. Oh, and Florida? I love doing old cars. And of course, this this is the Volkswagen. This was on Highway 62, Moyer Road. The Volkswagens are no longer there, but I did capture them and it was just after a rain, so the colors were really vibrant and I really, I must have taken 100 pictures. I really enjoyed the photo shoot. And there's Florida, the old cars. And that was in Sop Choppy on, on the Panhandle area which is our favorite area to go in Florida. 
And I just said to my husband, I said, stop the car, stop the car. He goes, what's going on? I says, oh my gosh, look at those treasures over there. He goes, what? One of those what things again. But, oh, I just love that. And there again, it had just rained, so lots of vibrant colors. Sop Choppy, what a name. And so these, I like taking reflection pictures. This is on the Napanee River. We were going along with our boat, and uh, I captured this reflection shot. And then taking a break, Renfrew County. And that was, that was two photographs. There was some Muskoka chairs on a dock. And then there was a lovely uh, background of the fall leaves. So I put those together and uh, I think it's magic. And seasons change, I think is really dear, dear and sweet. And Algonquin Park, I took a, a picture of the mist and I took a picture of this heron flying. So they're two separate pictures. So I merged them together and got a really nice shot. And oh, I love taking black and whites of my family members. Aren't they sweet? Black and whites are a lot of fun. Oh, focus, this was um, uh, in Holland where they have all the amazing tulips and I just wanted to get a little focal point and the rest kind of blurred and uh, I think I've succeeded. Succeeded. <laughs> And of course, who can think of uh, sunflowers in Ukraine? So I had these lovely sunflowers from the garden, so I put them on the couch and uh, got a really good picture out of it. I think, anyway. And then, of course, I used to think the winter was, oh, not a very nice time to go out and take photos, but I love it now. The sculpture pieces of the ice, just amazing, just amazing. And of course, I can't forget my hobby at Christmas time playing Santa. Isn't he cute? <laughs> anyway, that's my photographic art. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, today I could say I'm a true successful immigrant story. That being and saying, I'm an artist. Yay! Uh, I hope that you can uh, join our studio tour. Uh, I look forward to chatting with you and showing you my process. The tour is guaranteed to put a smile on your face and you'll have a great day. Thank you.